Take a look at this Instagram account. It has nearly 400,000 followers and it only posts beautiful, soothing nature reels. If we go back to the early post of this account, you'll see that the reels had average views and likes. But the moment they started posting these eye-catching nature reels, the account began to blow up. For instance, if we look at the first post of this kind, it was uploaded in March. This means the account gained the majority of its followers in just three months and the engagement skyrocketed, turning it into a popular account quickly. Here's another example. This account has over 150,000 followers and follows a similar strategy, posting stunning nature reels, and it also gained rapid follower growth and high engagement. Now you might be wondering how these accounts are making money. Let me explain. If we go back to the first account, you'll see a link in the bio that redirects users to a website. This is where they earn money by selling various items. You can see they sell various wallpapers and uh, even courses on how to create videos like theirs. We can see from here that they made more than 1600 sales and they also have an option for visitors to leave tips. But that's not the only way to earn money. Another account we looked at is making money through streams of its lo-fi music on various platforms. Apart from all these, you can also by selling posters, frames, and merchandise, and all other creative ways. Now, in the beginning, I would suggest you to not focus on money. First, try to build a good following, and once you have gained a certain number of followers, then you can think of different ways to monetize. Trust me, having a good follower base, like 100k followers, is a great thing to have. That's 100k potential customers for any product or service you want to promote. Now, Meta might or might not monetize these videos, but you can't rely solely on that. You need to constantly find new ways ways to generate income and with a large follower base it becomes much easier hello everyone and welcome back to the channel in today's video i will show you how to create soothing nature videos like this i'll explain every single step in detail so make sure you pay attention and don't forget to subscribe to the channel because i create some of the best ai tutorials in the game now without further ado let's get started now the first and most important thing we need for this is images and the prompts to generate those images. Make sure you watch till the end because I will show you a trick that will make you a prompt expert so you'll never have to worry about prompts again. Now these accounts use Midjourney to generate the images which is basically the best image generator available but it's not free. So we will use a free tool that can generate high quality images like these. I've tried multiple free image generators but nothing comes close to the Google Colab tool called Focus and we will be using that to generate our our images. Now after generating few images with this, I found that if you provide this a reference image, then it works even better. So I have downloaded a few reference images, which I will also put in the description for you to use if you want. I've already made a very detailed video on focus, so you can go and check that out by clicking the I button above. To open focus, go to your web browser and search for Focus Google Colab and click on this link. Then you will see something like this. From here, click on connect and let it connect to the GPU. After that, click on this play button to execute the code. This might take a bit of time. Once done, you need to click on this Gradio link, which will take you to the main interface. After that, click on advanced. And from this section, select quality. This will make the AI focus on quality rather than generation speed. Next, select the aspect ratio from the drop down menu. Then go to style and select the SAI anime option. Next, go to the input image section and click on image prompt and upload your reference image here. And then scroll down and click on advanced. Then change this value to 0.6 and turn this all the way up. Now come to the prompt section, paste your prompt and hit generate. Don't worry. I'll put all the links and prompts in the description. Once the generation is done, you'll see how awesome the images look. Trust me, this kind of result is hard to find anywhere else for free. Now, if you're happy with the image, download it. Otherwise, you can regenerate it. Let's try generating one more image. This time, I'll use this image as a reference and will also use a different prompt, then hit generate. Once it's done, you can see that the image turned out to be beautiful. Next, download the image you want. Now let's upscale the downloaded images. To do that, go to upscale or variation and upload the image here. Next, select any of the options from here. I'll choose this one and hit generate. This will upscale the image nicely. Next, I'm going to edit the image a bit to make it more appealing. I'm using Microsoft's built-in image editor for this but feel free to choose any image editor of your choice this step isn't mandatory but since people will only see the image for a few seconds we need to make sure it's eye-catching and attention grabbing and this is how it looks after editing and now we will be adding some 3d motion effects to take it to the next level we'll use a website called leapix ai for this it's free and works like a charm first go to leapix-ai.com and sign up using your email id 
After signing up, you'll see an interface like this. Now upload the image from here and it will start processing the image. Once done, you can choose different kinds of motions from here. As you can see, there are multiple options available. I will choose this one and click on export, then select MP43T motion and click on next. Now you don't need to do anything in this section, so just click next, then make sure 30 FPS is selected and click on export and let it process the file. Once done, you can download it. Now I will follow the exact same process to add motion effects to the next image as well and don't worry there won't be any watermarks after you download them and now the only step left is to add some music to do this you'll need a video editor i'm using microsoft clipchamp but feel free to use any other video editor of your choice or you can skip this step and add trending music while uploading on instagram now drag and drop the music file here I downloaded this from the YouTube music library. Next, add the video clip and adjust the length of the audio to match it. Then make sure you adjust the video to fill the frame. Then simply export the video and you are done. And now let's see how it looks. As you can see, they look amazing. Now I have used random music from the YouTube audio library to avoid copyright, but make sure you are choosing the right kind of soothing music or you can just use the music these accounts are using. And there you have it folks, high quality nature reels using only free tools. I was able to create this within a few minutes. Now imagine what you can do with a bit more effort and creativity. Now as promised, let me tell you how you can become a prompt expert. It's very simple. First, go to this website, upload the reference image and click on generate prompt. It will give you the prompt to generate images similar to your reference image. You can use this for any kind of image you want to generate. Just upload your image and it will give you the prompt. Now you will never need to worry about high quality prompts again. If you found this video useful, give it a like and please support the channel by subscribing. If you have any questions, make sure you comment below and I'll be happy to answer your questions. Thank you so much for watching and as always keep grinding.